Do you know what? You can't crucify yourself. You can't become a living sacrifice by yourself. Mm -hmm. God has to do it. But what you can do is crawl up on the altar <laughs> and you can tell God, God, I'm aware that I'm just living out of my own steam, my own power, that I'm trusting in myself. God, I need you. And you crawl up there in, in Romans 12, 1. I make myself a living sacrifice. And God, I ask your fire to fall and consume me. God showed that to me at Christmas in 1967. And four months later, after meditating on Romans 12, 1 and 2 for, for four months, That's good. I had a miraculous encounter with God where God showed up. And I'm convinced that that was a result of me desiring to be a living sacrifice. I didn't know how to do it. I couldn't do it to myself, but that was my desire. And as I made that known to the Lord, I think that's the reason he showed up March the 23rd, 1968 and changed my life. So you, can, you have to begin the process. He won't force himself upon you. Yeah. He's not going to make you submit. You have to express it. God, I want to be this way. I want to die to myself. I want to be a living sacrifice. And then you put yourself on the altar. And if you are serious, mm -hmm. God will accept your sacrifice. Amen. I really believe that. Okay.